Is the will of God hard to obey? Certainly not. You know, the will of God is one of the easiest things to do. All you need to, to is to obey because the word of God is the will of God. Where go, if God speaks, if you obey, you'll be blessed. And today's reading is coming from the book of Psalms chapter 40 verse 8. And the Bible says, I delight to do thy will, O God. Yea, thy law is within my heart. The psalmist say that he was delightful to do the will of God. You know, our God is a faithful God. There's no way that our God can tell us to do something that we are not capable of doing. If he gives you an instruction, obey it because within you lies power and grace to be obedient to him. You know, and I've, 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 when you search the Bible, throughout the scriptures, you'll see something that is very consistent. You'll see that the will of God is to benefit man, mankind. There's, when God gives you an instruction, it is not to benefit him, but to, is to benefit us as the children of God. You know, like for example, the universal will of God is that every man should be saved. And, and, and God's will is so supreme. That's why he sent his only son to die for us, that we may believe in him and so that we may be saved. You see, his will is to see us saved. We are the one who will benefit because we'll not see the eternal flames of hell, but we'll be saved and live with him in heaven forever. The will of God is to benefit us. So the will of God is not for us to debate it mm -mm. and to discuss and to question it, no. Never question the word of God, because the word of God is the will of God. Never question the will of God. Our duty is to obey the will of God and to respond by faith and obedience. So I encourage you today, be thankful for the scriptures. Be thankful for the word of God. Be thankful for the will of God, because the will of God is primarily designed to benefit us. Let's pray. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I thank you for my listeners. Father, the, 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 the grace to be obedient to your will is working in them in the name of Jesus, that they will be obedient to your call. When you call them, when you instruct them, when they read the scriptures and meditate upon and ponder upon your word, they, the grace to fulfill that word will work, in, will work in them and they will fulfill your word by being obedient and they will reap the fruit thereof. For therefore, Lord, I thank you and I bless your holy name in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a tremendous day in Jesus' name.